I've been drinking, I've been drinking. My name is Scott Lark. I'm a sophomore, 19. My friends believe that I'm an alcoholic. For me, I feel like I just like to turn the fuck up. You feel what I'm saying? When there's something to do, I'm going to go get me a bottle and I'm going to turn the fuck up. You know what I'm saying? If it's something to do every day, that means I'm drinking every day. And when there's nothing to do, I'm not drinking. But I'm still drinking even when I'm not drinking. On Sunday. After church. The same thing for the people that should have loved you the most are the people that hurt you the most. That's what he wants to remind you of. That's what he's drawing you back in that place. Turn up for Jesus. Hallelujah. Everybody thinks I'm an alcoholic. My drinking started at the age of 12. I was early with it. You know what I'm saying? Seagram's Gin was the first thing I ever drank. You know what I'm saying? And now that I've gotten older, I'm on baller or alcohol. Bombay, Ciroc, absolute, fuck with me. I like to drink, I like to have fun, I, and ain't nothing better than, only thing better than drinking is drinking for free. Amazing. Are you drunk right now? No, I'm sober right now, but I'm about to go get drunk. I am now coming to see Scott, check on him. What's up, bro? What is that, your boy? Chillin', chillin', doing this thing for documentary. Scott! What you up to? What the fuck are you Nothing. Early. What time? It is Monday. Look at this. <laughs> look at this. You are some alcoholic. Look, look at this. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> now, Scott, how long have you had this bottle? It is Monday and it's not one. I probably, I had about an hour. What you gonna do with the rest of that? The fuck you mean? You gonna drink that? I think you should just give that, give him up. No, give him up, Scott. No, you don't need that. For what? You turned already. What you mean, Scott? You have a class in an hour. I don't give a fuck. You good, Scott? I'm telling you. We the can teacher say this don't even. Friday. Friday. Me and the teacher gonna drink this together. All right. Well, I think that you're becoming an alcoholic and you need to get your life together. I think that you are becoming Oprah. I don't give a fuck. Scott. All right, this is really good. Scott. Hey, Scott. Right. What's going on? How many drinks have you had today? Because now it's... I've, I've met you at about 11, and I, now it's it's about 5 o'clock. I took shots at some Jack. This is my second daiquiri with shots of Everclear in it. Um... So this is my second dagger. This is my second Ooh. dagger today. Dagger. And I had shots of Jack earlier this earlier today. So you have three. a you, it's my third drink today. It's Monday, Scott. Nigga don't care, nigga don't care, nigga don't care. Scott just got his refund Scott. check. It's been about a, it's been about a couple hours. And this is the first thing he buys. How much did you spend? Oh, it's about two thirty. Solo. One man. What else did you get? Oh, polo down, everything, you know what I'm saying? No, I meant, what, what did you buy in, in the box? What's in the box? Oh, oh it's alcohol. Oh, you know what I'm saying? Some rock, drone, some goose, the honey. Document. Motor rock, you know what I'm saying? Just another day, Mardi Gras 2014. So, we have finessing the mall. We all have been there, been there. All the buttons got them out here. All the buttons got them out What do you know about Scott, and how do you feel about Scott? Yes, I know Scott Lark. Um, he he has a drug problem. He's an alcoholic. It's really sad. Like, if I knew the number to AA, I would send him because it's just getting real reckless. Every time I see him, he got a daiquiri cup in his hand. Uh, Scott is an alcoholic. Every time I see Scott, he has a, a daiquiri in his hand. You know, it's very sad to see him become this alcoholic. Even though he is my friend, we gotta get him some help. If I knew the, not, the number to to the AA or the AA meetings, you know, we would take him, but he ain't trying to hear all that. <laughs> yeah, I know, Scott. 
Scott. Scott is some some like my brother. I see him every day, and and every day when I see him, he always has a, a dagger in his hand. Scott is some like an alcoholic, and it's just like he ain't got no hope. All he do is drink, 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 and smoke, drink and smoke. I don't ever see him in class. I got a class with him. He ain't never there. Okay, I wake up in the morning and I see dollar sign. Shawty wanna roll and I'm like, oh man, she fine. I got my one question. How do you guys feel? To have your grandson back for you, with you guys for a little while. Wonderful. Oh, great. Love All it. right. Yeah. I feel good. <laughs> I've been trying to get in touch with him. In my room, it's about almost noon. Do you know that this motherfucker just threw up in my room? I came up here. What? <laughs> just as. <laughs> Scott, all right, man, for real, you know, we back where we started, you know, you got to get together, you're throwing up, finals week, you know, we got to get it together, how would me and my feel, if, bro, if she knew you was drinking all the time, we just seen her, we went to Atlanta, she, she would be pretty disappointed, she'd be very disappointed, she'd be very upset, she'd be worried, she'd be worried. and how do you feel about it, like, you do you know you have a problem? I feel like I don't have a problem, but I feel like I may be developing a problem. Alright, that's I guess that's the first step. So, what are you gonna do, Scott? I mean, you don't even plan to go here next year. Let's you going to a new school. Are you gonna do this, are you gonna keep the same habit next year or what? I mean same shit gonna happen next year. Mardi Gras gonna happen next year. Party's gonna happen next year. So of course I'm gonna I'm still drink, but I mean maybe I just need to drink more control. What do you mean more control? I need to know what I'm drinking, how much I'm drinking, and, and monitor when. Not maybe not as often. Maybe just socially. Okay. And once or twice or two weeks. Are you willing to get help? It's possible. Sure. Yeah. I've never rejected help. Alright. So Scott, I'm here. You know, we've been we had a long year together. You know what I'm saying? We started off our freshman year together, you left, you came back. You throwing up in my bathroom, that's 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 gonna stop. <laughs> Just throwing up in my room, that's not gonna happen no more. But no, I'm here for you, so I got you, you know, if you need help. If you need to go somewhere, if you need to seek professional help, I'm with you. You know I drink with you, so you know we gonna cut that that weekday drinking. That's gonna stop for real. Oh, we can't have this no more. You need to get your life together. We gonna get it together. I'm gonna get it together. Get up on my level. 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 Get up on my level.